Love and light, my divine feminines and divine masculine collective. Thank you guys so much for tuning in and clicking on the video. This reading is going to be heavy, okay? It is going to be heavy. So um, bear with me because we are going to get into it. I got tons of downloads. Um, what I wanted to start doing for the channel, guys, is I really wanted to start incorporating more um, scripture, more just word of god okay because i feel like in this tarot community we can really forget that these gifts that these light workers us that we receive are from god right whoever your god is however you interpret the messages that god and spirit give you and i just didn't want to stray away from that in the last video you guys know that um i was you know adding prayer and i want to add more things like that because that is the reason why i started this channel in the first place was for all of us to understand that there's divine masculine and divine feminine in both of us but in order to get the divine part we need god for that okay so i did get a couple downloads let's jump into prayer and then we'll go straight into it Father God, angels, ancestors, divine Holy Spirit, please go ahead and protect my intuition, protect this platform, and protect the viewers that clicked on the video. Whatever they are sending myself, send back to them. If they are sending love and light, bless that to them and their families. And if they are sending any evil eye, just return to sender. In this day and age, guys, I just like to teach the simple law that the energy you give out is the same energy that you're calling back into yourself, okay? And I've been feeling a lot of energy being given out right and so just know that it's going to be received back okay so let's go ahead and jump into it so the first okay let's pull some cards and then i'll go into the downloads just see if they align spirit please give me a clear accurate message they're telling me to use a different deck okay Clear, accurate message. Clear, accurate message. Okay, emotional withdrawal. Eight. And I feel like that's what the collective needs to do right now is just pull back emotionally from a lot of people, places, and things, okay? The word that I was getting was infiltrate. I've been getting this word right before I came on camera, and I actually had to look it up just to get the exact meaning of what this word meant and the um, definition of the word is to enter or gain access to gradually in order to gain secret information and i feel like there is a lot of people around the collective right now myself included that is trying to infiltrate into your life into your business into everything that you got going on but they're doing it gradually okay these people are doing it very um smoothly very sly very gradually okay and these people i don't really know what they want to find out um I'm, then i just heard income 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 so maybe these people want to find out like your income how much you're making um, all these kind of things which you know people really just need to focus on themselves but so i do feel like you do need to emotionally withdraw yourself from people places and things because um people don't have the best intentions right now is what i'm saying. okay the next scripture that i got was or the first scripture that i got was samuel 17 and it says i would choose twelve thousand men and attack him when he's weak and weary i will strike him with terror and then his people will flee so i feel like right now whether you have family friends whatever it is i feel like there is people around you that is trying to infiltrate into you and these are low vibrational people so these light workers including myself right we vibe at such a high level but when we do have these people around us especially if you're an empath it is so easy for you to pick up on their energy and almost take on their energy as if it is your own i can say that that has been happening for myself as well little personal inside information so this morning i had a really rough day today guys but when i really took the time to just pull back and understand i'm like this energy is not mine this energy is not mine at all um i had a really wonderful dream it was so such a beautiful dream of like my future and 
it, it was just so realistic and I think that that was spirit telling me like this is what is to come you know everything that you've been praying for and envisioning like was shown to me in a dream and um, it was so vivid and so real but the second I woke up and actually snapped back into reality my mood shifted and it was almost like the devil had to bombard me infiltrate me thank you spirit infiltrate me in um, this 3d because it's not in this 3d right now if that makes sense so I feel like you're even being infiltrated in the spirit realm there are spirits there are um, people around you chills confirmation but there are people that are trying to infiltrate and not just people but spirit as well um low vibrational um <laughs> workers you know for the dark side that are trying to infiltrate you because what before the blessing there's always you know there's always negativity before blessing okay but with that i asked god okay so we do see that there is people all around the collective that is trying to infiltrate trying to find out information trying to dig into their life like as if they got something to hide but um what are, what, what are we what are we to expect with that right what is to come with that and before we move forward let me pull a couple more cards what can we expect spirit can we see how it aligns Okay, suffering in silence, in reverse. So I feel like people wanted you to suffer in silence, right? They wanted to block your throat chakra. Nine is a singular energy to me as well. But they wanted you to suffer in silence and make you seem like there is no distant horizon, no light outside, right? No light in the distance. They wanted you to be suffering in silence and just feeling like that's it, right? what what was the scripture uh, i will i will choose 12000 men so there is literally um and i'm getting more yes in the physical but of course in the spirit we do not fight against people we fight against principalities right and the chosen ones if you're truly chosen you know that you are put up against so many people and entities and spirits to try to um tear you down and stop you from your mission and um i feel like this is what a lot of these um people deities energies are trying to do but they need they need thousands do you hear that Twelve thousand men and i will attack him so there is one of you against twelve thousand. now it doesn't have to be that many but i do feel like there is a huge part of the chosen collective that is feeling like they're going up against so many and it's like at, at what point at what point is is they're going to be some kind of you know ease right why do i have to fight so hard why do i have to keep battling because people want to keep you suffering in silence because your voice is your power okay anyway it says i will attack him when he is weak and weary i will strike him with terror and then his people will flee so for my chosen ones the way the way that you speak and the way that you get your messages out i resonate with this myself you are calling your tribe your vibe attracts your tribe right you are calling the masses by the many people are gathering people are seeing people are seeing how chosen you are and you're creating this this impact right you're creating this wave of a vibrational heightening right and then there's lower vibrational entities say we need to stop right we need to stop this we need to keep people dumbed down and isolated and and quiet right because if not then they're going to it's just going to spread like wildfire and 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 that's not what the devil wants right and so that's why i also really was called to add more scripture and more um word into these because the word is power right now take it how it resonates words have power words create manifesting words have the power to change outcomes and break strongholds and i feel like um when i add these kind of scriptures in it even if you're a believer or not it may hit you in a way okay and when you stand on that word you become almost unstoppable okay so with that let's keep going anything else to clarify because i do have the message that god um relayed to me after these uh, people wanted to yeah material material harvest in reverse and another nine so these people wanted to block your material harvest right they wanted to stop you they wanted you to suffer they wanted to attack you when you're weak and weary so that you can feel defeated 
right? But I feel like there's a lot of you guys that have things going on that people don't even know. Yes, new beginnings. I can't make it up. Zero. Back to a brand new start. And look, you are standing on top of the whole entire world. You have the... You, 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 this is how powerful you guys are. And I think I'm talking to females or or feminine energy at least. But you are standing on top of the world. Okay? You are unbreakable. Unshakable. And this is what people don't understand. Right? You hold the power. You are connected to divine. You have the answers. You are the keeper of the keys. Alright? So let's keep going. One more. Okay, yeah, do you see this? And with this new beginning, these people wanted you here. Discontent and bored and trapped in fear. But I'm telling you that this is this is not going to be happening. This is not going to be happening. These are the things that people wanted for you, right? What is to come, spirit? What is to come? What is to come? Oh, goodness. I feel like for a while, excuse me. I feel like for a while you guys had to pull back. I know myself had to pull back as well. And I was just, I had to redirect myself and I had to say, okay, God, what is, what is the mission here? Okay. What is the mission? Yes, we are here to heighten and awaken the collective, but what is the mission? What is the end goal? What are, what are we trying to do? Okay. To gain our authority, right? To gain our authority, in the spirit realm to gain our authority in the physical realm right to venture in those new beginnings right to really understand that we are the ones that can change our outcomes the waiting game came out in reverse because we are no longer waiting what have i been saying for weeks if you want to see the change you need to be the change and i feel like the collective including myself has been really taking the time to make those changes and make those impacts okay so let's go ahead and I want to go ahead and clarify the other scripture that I got. It is a little bit of reading, so bear with me if you resonate. But when Samuel 17 came and it was, I would choose 12,000 men and attack him when he is weak and weary. I will strike him with terror and then, and then his people will flee. Okay, this is what God says, Israel's only survivor. But now this is what the Lord says, he who created you, Jacob, he who formed you, Israel, do not fear, for I have redeemed you. I have summoned you by name. You are mine. When you pass through the waters, I will be with you. And when you pass through the rivers, they will not sweep you over. When you walk through the fire, you will not be burned. The flames will not set you ablaze for I am the Lord, your God. Okay. And that is where I'm going to end that there. But I just want chills everywhere because I want you guys to know that you guys have been hand picked, hand picked. Okay. That's what I kept hearing. Hand picked. You have been hand picked in the spirit realm and in the physical realm you have this light that radiates off of you you carry this energy that vibrates inside of you and people see that people see that then they don't only see that they feel that you could walk into a room and i've been getting this a lot i could walk into the grocery store and it's just like all eyes on me you know all eyes on me and i keep hearing that as well you walk into wherever you go all eyes are on you and people want to know what's going on they want to infiltrate right some people want to infiltrate in a positive way and just find out little things about you but majority of them people want to infiltrate in negative ways and just want to so nosy right so nosy because they see the light that you carry so they create all these assumptions of who you are and what you have and how you get it right but i just want you to know that you have been handpicked handpicked hand delivered by the most high you are always protected okay so let's go ahead and dive in just a little bit more here i don't know why but they're telling me to go ahead and get get a little bit of tarot um yeah we will Okay, so here we have clear, accurate message, please. The chariot. Okay, so somebody is looking out into the horizon and going to be making fast action, fast decision, fast movement into a new direction. Okay, we have the two of wands. You have, again, the world in your hands. The world is in your hands. You're looking out and you're saying, you know what? I can go ahead and do whatever I want. I can be whoever I want. I can do whatever I want. And you're finally taking the action upon that, which is very good. So congratulations. 
Okay, but let's see what your message wants to come out. Okay. Beautiful energy. So yes, again, you, they want me to switch it, but yes, three of wands and three of cups. You are, mm, I'm getting two things and I'm going to share them. It was this way. So I feel like um, you have the world in your hands and you're leaving maybe these three people, three past people in the past and you're looking on to better ventures, right? But then I'm also getting it this way where you do have the world in your hands, you're taking fast movement forward and you're realizing, hey, I have now completely turned my back, right? The two of wands, you are half, half, you know, deciding still deciding right but then i feel like now you're fully turning your back to the past turning your back to whatever was behind and and for mo some of you most of you it, it was you know past people maybe three women maybe three men maybe three family members maybe three different choices whatever it is you're turning your back to that but then i'm also getting because you're turning your back to that now you're going to be in this celebratory energy you're going to be able to reap with new new memories right there's food there's harvest your cups are overflowing there's laughter there's joy you're you're draped in 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 um nice cloth right is what i'm getting so that's what i have so far let's keep going i do have a song that i um wanted to jump into wow nine of cups and the ten of pentacles do you see there is always strife before your blessing i can't make this up guys you are sitting if you're not sitting in this now you will be very soon just like that dream that i had right you were getting downloaded or if you're not yet you will be in this is confirmation you will be sitting in this in this harmonious energy in your authority do you see how this is the same arms crossed no one can touch me nothing can penetrate my energy i am the king queen empress emperor of my life i am content i am satisfied i am fulfilled i am in the ten of pentacles the ten of pentacles is one of the be most beautiful cards in the deck for me ten of pentacles uh, ten of cups and the sun right this is such a beautiful energy such a beautiful energy but what 12,000 men have to come up against you when you're and, and and make you feel weak right people want to infiltrate you and 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 um, gain information in in such sneaky little ways right people want to project their energy on you to make you feel some type of way but this is what's to come they want you to get off don't think about this right it's so crazy how I had such a beautiful dream. And, and through my hardship today, through the struggle and through the stress today, that wasn't even my own. My day was beautiful. There was moments of such stillness. And each time in that moment, I kept remembering that dream that I had. It was like spirit, God kept directing me back to that dream. But then it would be overtaken by, by energy that, that really wasn't mine outside energy people trying to infiltrate your energy people trying to infiltrate your dreams people trying to infiltrate your blessings right but it's like you've had things going behind the scenes people don't see what's going on behind the scenes and i almost feel like in a sense god is doing this because god god ordains everything right and i almost feel that god is almost allowing the devil to come and kind of infiltrate into these things to to almost trick these these um lower vibrational energies to make them think that you're down right that you're in this in this discontent and boredom that you're trapped in fear that you're suffering in silence that you're emotionally withdrawn but really really you're standing in your authority and you know that but it's almost like you have to trick the collective, the, the, the lower vibrational collective, okay? So that's a very beautiful energy. And congratulations, guys. I just keep hearing that, congratulations. Let's just dive in a little bit more. They're telling me that's enough for that. So let's go ahead and see what could be around you could be around you change 
at the bottom of the deck another nine nines are significant i've been seeing nines a lot as well but nine 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 and um maybe look that up should we look that up no if you feel interested look it up and comment down below i would love it to see what you guys pick up when you google that number but um let's go ahead and see what um who could be involved in this infiltrating who could be the ones that are kind of meddling meddling in your business is what i'm hearing but there's blessings to come spirit what do you want to say house okay so there's something regarding a house which is two i also see partnership and alliance okay let's see what else oh goodness unexpected income which is eight abundance this is what you have to look forward to guys this is what you have to expect in the near future i feel like this is just a reminder sudden wealth 11. i can't make it up do you see god isn't like god they're saying don't even focus don't even focus on who's trying to infiltrate you right because this is just a reminder this is just the little the, the little sum up this is what the collective wants you to be right there's people infiltrating you there's people trying to twelve thousand people trying to come against one right now we don't fight against people, we fight against principalities, but you know what I mean, okay? But God is saying right before your blessing, right before your blessing, main male. So maybe this could be happening with a main male or maybe this could be regarding a main male, okay? Oh, wow, I have another card in here. So let's see what that is. Transformation. Because of all this transformation, this is what you're expecting. And when you do get this, this is going to transform you into a whole different being as what I'm hearing. Okay, courthouse. So maybe something could be going on in the courthouse. Now they're telling me to jump into the music message that I got. And this is Daylight by Kanye West. I went ahead and I just put Pandora on when I was, you know, doing my channeling. And... Um, now really listen to these lyrics i'm going to read them out i don't know the song but just listen to these lyrics now it first starts off as i can 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 two 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 on the clock when i said that so this is really important for it to start off saying i can okay now hear this i am there for the kids i am trying to live for them i'm trying to change the script Sometimes it just can't be did. I'm dead, lifeless, untold silence, and I blame it on the system because it was never set up for us to win. Manager, you look like you need a manager, someone that can handle you, someone of my caliber, someone that's gonna handle all your business, trying to balance you. This is about me and you, okay? Day and night, 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 daylight, 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 empty. Please do not tempt me. They want to end me with the same knife they tried to hand me. I can't pretend it's, I can't pretend it's don't do, don't do forgetting, okay? I can't pretend it's don't do forgetting, but you're still forgiven, oh baby, day day and night day and night day and night okay but if i gotta sleep alone tonight i swear that my choice won't be right i swear that my choice won't be right when i am alone i too many options too many problems you want to be my hero and try to solve them but if i gotta sleep alone tonight i promise you she just mine for the night who's to say that the choice will be mine who's to say that the choice will be right who's to say that the choice will be right day light day light day light day light okay so i do feel, let, let me sum it up so i do feel like there is this um this energy and i don't want to even put it masculine and feminine but i do feel like there is this energy right and you're trying to impact and make some kind of impact for the future generation and i feel like that is what you get on here for this is why you do what you do this is why you strive to push what you do and i can resonate with with this myself you want to make positive impact right and i feel like you're you feel like what did it say they're trying to cut you they want to end me with the same knife they tried to hand me 
okay so it's like people are trying to stop you they're trying to infiltrate you they're trying to get thousands of people up against you right to to stop you from the same thing they tried to hand you you see what i'm saying the same sword they tried to hand you you took it and made beautiful mountains out of it and now they want you to come crashing down with that same thing that they handed you all right but it's like daylight 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 right people are trying to make you feel empty please don't tempt me right don't tempt me now it comes into more of this relationship aspect that i'm getting all right, I'm getting that there is this man here or this masculine energy. And he's like, if I got to sleep alone tonight, I feel like my choice won't be right. I swear my choice won't be right. Too many options, too many problems. You want to be my hero and try to solve them. So I feel like this top energy is a different energy that wants to try to solve problems, wants to try to help people, wants to try to awaken people, right? That's what I'm getting. But I feel like this, maybe it's this main male here, right? And this main male just has too many options, too many problems, too many things around him. Him. and he knows that if he has to sleep alone there's something with this aloneness like i feel like this energy does not like to be alone or doesn't like to sleep alone or there's something so he'd rather um anybody right anybody but it's like th then you get in that same cycle of bad choices and you know and and it's like um what did he what, what was the lyrics you know it will only be mine for the night i promise you she's just mine for the night who's to say that my choice will be mine who's to say that my choice will be right right so they're going back in this karmic this karmic energy of of just you know clinging on right clinging on to past clinging on to the the, the lower vibrational energy because they don't want to be alone they don't want to they don't want to feel alone they don't want to be isolated right On my side of mention out of fence, I got something in the rants, in the rants. Had a song, call under line, hold a line, golden mine, I'm done. I've been holding by design, I've been holding by design. I've made by, I'm, I've am i been made by design in the night, in the summer. You know you're a lover in design, daylight, daylight. God made me done, God made me the done, dawn. God made me your own, locked in, be your own nightmare. I've been made being song. Got pain, been alone, can't pay for your love. I might, I feel your pain, 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 pain. The heartbreak I took, the heartbreak I took. Okay, so I feel like with all of this, with all of this, you see how they tie back into like God. And it's like God has made you who you are. God is going to carry you through what you are going through. God is god has made you designer god has made a perfect design out of you is what i'm getting and i feel like locked in be your own nightmare that's what i'm hearing right going back to my dream do you understand it's like it's not a nightmare though that's what i'm getting it's like you're dreaming this perfect beautiful life and then you wake up and that's when the life begins if that makes sense you know what i mean i feel your pain i feel your pain the heartbreak i took i feel like both of these energies took such heartbreak took such loss took such pain right and it's like what's going to be done with that though what's going to be done with that i got pain been alone can't pay for your love i might so i feel like this energy here confirmation is so used to um transactional love is what i'm getting and i feel like he needs it he wants it he doesn't know how to go about it he wants that change he sees that you're here for the kids i know i'm trying to live for them i'm trying to change the script sometimes it just can't be did i'm dead i'm lifeless untold silence and i blame it on the system because it was never set up set up for us to win and this is what this masculine energy is seeing in this other energy okay so take it how it fits you place it as you want but that's just the song and i i would highly recommend listening to that song i haven't really listened to it that was the first time i heard it but they told me look up the lyrics and i when i really looked up the lyrics i didn't even read all the way until now but i was just like oh my gosh that hits exactly to the energy of what i'm pulling right it feels like it can't be done because the society and the system has set this this way up 
almost for us to fail, right? To be stuck in this system, to be stuck in this mindset, to be stuck in this mentality. And it's like, you're trying so hard to break that paradigm, to break that shift. And I feel like there is somebody who, who, who is more of a designer, right? Who is more of that lots of options, lots of problems, right? more money, more problems. And they see this though. They're starting to see how life is through the other energies, eyes, thank you, spirit. And now they're like, something can be done, right? I'm alone, I might just pay for your love because this, this masculine energy needs that. There is something, 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 something different with that light, right? It, it, it transforms people, right? While the outside energy is trying to keep you all in this lower vibration. This is the system. This is the society. These are the, you know, principalities, you know, the lower vibrations trying to keep you here. But look at what is to come. Remember that dream is what I'm hearing. Such a beautiful energy. Such a beautiful energy. And I know that the collective um, is, is feeling this. Is feeling this. Because I know I am. And usually things happen... You know, when I feel things, I feel things on such a grander scale. And it's just like people want to infiltrate you. People want to project energy on you. People want to find out what you're doing, who you're doing it with, why you, why this, where that, how much you're making money, where do you work, what, who are you having, you know, whatever. Whatever it is. Whatever it is, right? But to me, what was the first energy? Emotional withdrawal. It's time to pull back. It's time to pull back from everybody it's time to re-enter in some kind of not hermit stage because that's not what it is but like use your voice but use it in a different way stand in that authority is what i'm hearing and watch the transformation happen right watch the transformation begin okay even in the madness there is peace beautiful forgive them for what they forgive them they forgive them for they know not what they do okay exactly these people these people just like light workers were sent here to to have a mission right just like these light workers were sent here to um awaken there are lower vibrational energies that were sent here just to stop right i will choose twelve thousand men to attack him when he is weak and weary I will strike him with terror and then his people will flee. I want you guys to really understand that if you feel this energy where you feel like you are being infiltrated or you feel like people are trying to do this and that, it's just because what is to come is amazing. Your dreams, your wishes, your blessings. Forgive them now for they know not what they do. We fight against people, not principalities. Return that energy back to sender. You guys vibe way too high. And I know myself, I had to take some time. Like today was just like, my gosh, what is this energy? What is this energy? You know? And it's like, even in the madness, I still had those moments of peace. And every time I had that moment of stillness, I could hear the birds, I could hear the wind. Beautiful. I was brought back to that dream. So guys, this is the reading. I hope you guys enjoyed it. If you did, go ahead and like the video. Claim this message in for yourself. If you choose to look up what 999 means to you, feel free to comment it down below. I love to hear what your um, number meanings mean to you because they resonate in different ways for everybody but this is the reading guys i love you all so much thank you for all your love and support thank you for rocking with me understanding the messages that i deliver to you for just really vibing with my energy i really appreciate you all right big things are to come and i will see you soon bye